guys were yes. great. So with this, oh, okay. So oh. With, Jump in. Let's do your thing. Cut. So with this experience, did you all both have a college experience that it was fun to kind of relive those moments for the both of you? Did you both have a college experience that you could bring to the movie as you prepare for your roles? Yes. Yeah. Um, I went to a college that was also like a musical theater conservatory, so it was a little different, but I definitely brought experience to it. I think that Stepsisters has a much more classic college view. Yeah, mm -hmm. for sure. And I went to USC and lived on a, you know, that, that craziness of that. And my <laughs> personal college experience, experience was more like um, Dear White People. Mm -hmm. um, Mine too. <laughs> <laughs> all of us, baby. And it's all the same family. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, there's was, there was tons of things that, uh, you know, I feel like I was able to bring from a personal college experience into the, you know, crazy out of the fish out of water world of Kevin. Definitely. With, with the film, I mean, along with the comedic aspects, there were a lot of physical rigors, too, all the dancing and the mm -hmm. preparation. How hard was it to prepare for a lot of those dance moves that you had to do during the film? It was really hard. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it's so weird to admit it, but it was really, it was a lot of work. Mm -hmm. um, I think that it was much more work than I expected because I have a dance background. Mm -hmm. I'm not a dancer, but I come from musical theater and so I definitely have danced and I walked in feeling really confident that I had it down and then we started stepping and I realized that I had absolutely no idea what I was doing and just decided to commit to putting a lot of work into it because mm -hmm. you want to be able to breathe through the character and be truthful mm -hmm. and so I needed to do what Sandra would have done. With the film, there's such a strong sisterhood message and you provide kind of like that masculine jolt through through the film. You know, during the times when you were setting with the strong sisterhood, did you feel like you just were in a whole cohesive sister? <laughs> do you have a lot of sisters? You know, how was that? You know, I don't have any sisters by blood, mm -hmm. but I have sisters by just like life. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I keep saying this, it was so beautiful to see all these women, talented women, just really coming together and doing this thing. Like they work their asses off. Um, mm -hmm. And it shows, you know, it shows in the film. So it was a beautiful thing for me to see. Was it fun to kind of do this after doing Dear White People and to do, like you said, you both didn't have the traditional college experience like they had in the film. Was it fun to do this type of role? And, and what did you learn new about yourself by tackling this? It was so much fun, especially the whole sorority aspect. At mm -hmm. a conservatory, that doesn't really exist. Mm -hmm. um, like theater kids are theater kids. They all, they're like in their own sorority. So I liked that. and. Um, I loved the experience of like, we actually, the girls and I showed up three weeks before we started, everybody else started shooting. So we also lived in a hotel together. We drove every day to rehearsal together, had lunches together, dinner. So we had that sort of sisterhood sorority feeling mm -hmm. and I enjoyed it. Yeah. Yeah. For me, I mean the same thing. I mean, this was such a contrast to uh, anything else I've done. I mean, this is probably the closest thing that's to myself if that mm -hmm. makes sense, and it was mm -hmm. the lightest. I mean, I've done a lot of crazy shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, but it was, it was fun to just like step away from, you know, stuff and get have some fun, you know. Yeah. What was the, the most fun scene for both of you to shoot during the course of filming? Because there were so many fun elements with love and sisterhood, dancing, just a lot of fun things. What was your most, what was most memorable um, for you? I think Steptacular yeah, mm -hmm. was sure. the most so. memorable. Mm -hmm. um, it was a lot of work, but it was the most rewarding. And the girls and I, like when we finished finally shooting it, because we rehearsed lots of different things, but that spectacular choreography, we did every single day along with whatever else we were learning. Mm -hmm. So when we were done, it felt like we had given birth to something. I've never <laughs> actually given birth, but it just, I would imagine that, no, it's actually nothing like that. That is wrong. Amazing. But it was just explosive. Mm -hmm. And yeah. so we were really emotional and we bawled our eyes out and hugged each other. And that just was my, the most special moment for me. Yeah, mm -hmm. same for me. Just to see that, yeah. like, because, I mean, there was some whispers that were like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna get it done by the, <laughs> by the day. But they got it done, um, and it was so cool to see. There's so many people in that final scene. Uh, How many, where did all those people come from? Oh, okay. Oh. Well, there's a